it's me, Sorn, and you're back with Produce Sorn. So today, I wanted to, again, try to be the makeup guru that everyone wants me to be but I cannot be. Today, I was thinking of doing a get ready with me makeup look, kind of like girls night out type of makeup look. I actually filmed a makeup tutorial video last year. It's been a year now, so obviously a lot of my makeup routine and also a lot of my products are changed. So I have a lot of new interesting products that I want to introduce you guys about. So throughout this whole tutorial, I'll be telling you all the tips and tricks and also also introducing you guys to all my new really 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 good products so I hope you guys enjoy normally when I go out I don't really like to use like thick foundation especially these days when you're using mask and stuff it's just really suffocating so these days I've actually just recently changed my cushion so this is a cushion from a brand called naming I really like this because as you can see, the design is very cheek and then they also have a mirror here so when you're outside, you actually don't have to carry another mirror in your makeup bag you can just use this and then, you know, check yourself out this is actually foundation mixed so it gives you full coverage it gives you like a this like glowing shiny finish if you're like the type who wants your skin to look natural and shiny then I really suggest you guys this. I'm using Naming Layered Fit Cushion, SPF 50 plus. I'm using number 23. I'm gonna be applying this on today. Normally I spend the most time on my skin. The most important thing when it comes to doing makeup is to you know, do your skin properly. I love cushions that are light and also gives you full coverage because it's actually really hard to find. Some places have cushions that, you know, is okay, but then you end up applying on too much sometimes and just makes your face look really cakey and just really unnatural. And I actually did not put that much product on but it gives you like full coverage so that is why I wanted to suggest you guys to this terrific and wonderful product Also, one thing that I wanted to mention is this product comes in a very cute packaging It comes in a little um, like a magnet bag so when you are going out, you can just open this bag and then drop your cushion in and then just secure it and then be cute. The next thing I'm going to be doing is putting on a little bit of powder. No sebum mineral pack from Innisfree. I'm just going to dab it on my skin just so that it doesn't look too, too shiny, I would say. Maybe a little more on other places. I think we should be doing our brows first. I'm going to be using my heavy rotation um, palette for my eyebrows and obviously I'm going to be using this color the one with Hello. a big um, hole in the middle I'm going to first fill it in and then I'm going to be using another brush like this to just draw the lines here because I like my eyebrows to be kind of long to here I will just brush it out a little bit to make sure there's no clump of the product I don't use a pencil to draw my eyebrows I like to use powder because I feel like it's easier for me to control and also it looks really natural Now that we're done with our brows, we should do our eyes So I recently just got this really cute palette from my friend I didn't really open it yet so I haven't used this palette before so these are all the colors that comes in this palette I'm going to play safe and go for the colors that I normally won't use I would probably go for these four tones 
um, or maybe a little bit of burgundy but today I think I'll be using natural first and then I'll put rust on top and maybe at the end of it if I want to add some more like sass to my eye makeup I'll probably add a little of this penny color in I'm not so sure how this is gonna look but The reason why I like palettes from the States more is because it's really pigmented With this type of palette, you actually don't have to apply much Ah, okay I see you! Then I'm gonna add the rust color I just love pink I tried using like brown eyeshadows before but it just doesn't turn out as great as I thought it would be <sighs> I'm so bad at makeup <laughs> please forgive me I think that looks fine not bad right? okay we're gonna move on to our so I'm going to be using the fresh gel liner from Mersey to just fill in my my waterline and everything and then after that I'm going to be showing you guys how I actually draw my iconic liner Okay, now I'm going to move on to my gel liner So with gel liner, as I've said in many videos It's actually easy to use a gel liner if you use it every single day So for me to be able to accomplish the iconic gel liner that I draw every day It took me quite a while too So it's not like you're gonna be able to do it right away The tip is to just open your eyes Look at yourself in the mirror and just draw it up Because I have a really droopy, sleepy eyes I always have to draw it up Look at yourself in the mirror and then start drawing oh. See, just draw it up like that Same thing to the other side I'm gonna be doing my iconic lashes! As I mentioned in my TikToks and my Reels, my Instagram that I recently found a new product that is amazing because of this product I actually got rid of all my other lash making products and also my other mascaras so I've been using these two products from Naming also It's a lash making kit So one of this is a fixer And one is a black mascara I really like these two products because One, it's really easy to apply Two, it's really light You feel like this lightness on your lashes As a person who loves mascara And think that mascara is the most important routine of my makeup I think that these Two products is just amazing Normally when I was using other products I always have to bring my lash curler everywhere I go And I have to just keep like, you know, fixing it But after changing to this mascara I just feel like I have to curl it before I apply it on And then that's it My lashes will just be up like that for the whole day Just watch this and you guys will definitely understand where I'm coming from I will use my eyelash curler from Shiseido and I will curl my lashes first Like this And then I'm going to be using their fixer So this is what the fixer looks like This transparent formula I'll be applying this on the upper lashes and on the bottom lashes I like this fixer a lot because if I don't want to apply mascara on I can just use this as a fixer that will just lift your lashes up like this So on days that I don't just want my makeup to look like I did my makeup but I really did not um, I'll just use this to apply it on to just have like a lift like this So 
This is without applying the mascara. So like if I, if I want to go outside and be like, oh, I just want my lash to look like I just did a perm on it. I'll just use this product. As you can see up close, I will also apply it on the bottom lashes. So this is the mascara. As you can see, it's quite thin. And it's really easy to use because when the brush is thin, it's easy to do both your top lashes and bottom lashes. Ta-da! Guys, like, if this mascara product is not good, I would not be putting this in my video and telling the whole world about it. I cannot tell you how much I love this. It's just so, so amazing. <gasps> I'm loving this. Yay! I don't know what they put in here and the fixer, but dude, I would say the best product right now in the market is just so amazing. If you guys don't buy it now, you guys are really missing out. I'm telling you that. So I'm gonna be applying on my blush on. So I'm using the blush on from Naming also. I really like this blush on. It's called Naming Fluffy Powder Blush. You can also use this as an eyeshadow if you want to, but I'm just gonna use it as a blush on. And I really like this product because it just gives you like this like fluffy, natural cheeks. And it just looks really cute and natural. <laughs> it gives you just like this fluffy, young vibe. To your cheeks Ding. And then next I'm gonna be contouring my face As usual, just use a contour 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 brush And I'm using this super tempting from VT As usual, I'm going to be contouring my nose first And then, contour my face with just this brush. I normally don't really care, so I'm just like... But I know if you do it too much, it's not nice. I almost forgot. These days, I've been really into those like fluffy brows. I know they do a lot of these for models and also a lot of celebrities in Thailand. Um, so they just fluff up their eyebrows. So I also got another product from Naming. This is called the Naming Touch Up Brow Maker. So this is also transparent. It comes in a little brush like this and I'm just going to fluff up my brows a little bit. So I'm just going to do this. This is also good because on days where you want your brows to look very natural but then a little cheek looking, you can use this to kind of shape it and because the brush is tiny it's actually super easy to apply on like this yay and i like to make the the part on here kind of like stick out a little bit ooh, ooh. Mm -hmm. cute what else should we do what else is missing I kind of want to add more mascara <laughs> I'm always like this, I'm just like, I love to add on Cause I want my lashes To be as in your face as possible, so The most important thing right now that we have to finish is our lips I thought all the colors were cute, so I was like I'm just gonna get everything. These are the Naming Soft Touch Lip Tint and the Naming Dewy Glow Lip Tint. Honestly, I didn't know what type of makeup 
I was gonna have on today So I just decided to bring everything and just choose it here I'll show you guys the difference between these and this huh, It all comes in like a lip like this I think I'll just use this type for today The colors are so cute And I like this because it's kind of dewy and it gives your lips like a natural glow Before I love to carry like this lip gloss thing But these days after changing to, to naming's new product I don't really have to carry any of those with me anymore So this is more of like a two-in-one for me I'm just gonna try this Grant color This Grant color Let's see what it looks like Quite excited actually Ah. Wow. Okay. Okay. I just like to use my fingers to do this. <gasps> this is very cute. It's so cute. <gasps> this is so cute. Oh my god, this is so cute. It gives you like a velvet type of texture but then not too dry which i love i think i will gloss it up with this one so this one is the gloss type so i'm going to be trying on the gloss type just putting up like a finish touch ah. cute this is really cute for those of you who are interested don't forget to go check it out, I just love their um, packaging It's just so cheap and just so me So I'm going to be concealing some of my flaws My favorite concealer stick uh, These On my nose My nose comes up here I just got a new product from About Face This is a light lock powder The color is Mother It's like this... I don't know what to call it So I'm just gonna use this to kind of use it as like a highlighter I've seen a lot of people do this on TikTok So lately I've been kind of into it So I'm just gonna use a little bit of their product and kind of apply it on the cheeks Oh. Okay, now I know why people like this up here too. Just give it a little glow. Wow, and then on my nose. Oh, <gasps> snatch! Oh, <gasps> so nice. This is really nice. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh man, oh oh I want to actually add some shadows I'm going to be using the color chocolate to apply it on my eyes right here To make my eyes look a little bit more fierce Since we're gonna go out today We're gonna go out and about and go on an adventure We want our eyes to look snatched Apply it on top of my liner Up here This side too mm -hmm. Oh no Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no Oh no! Aha! I'll apply a little bit To make my face look more fierce and kinda... Oh wow! Should we add this penny? Why not? Oh no, I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't know where to put it. I'm just gonna add it on. Oh! 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 Okay, maybe I put it too much. I need to blend it out. I need to blend it out. I need to blend it out. Okay, I'm blending. Okay, okay, okay. 
Ah, oh, it's not bad. Lastly, for the finishing touch, I'm going to be using Naming Reflecting Pure Fixer. Do you see it? It's, it looks really glowy. And we love that because your face is shiny and it gives you like a natural glow. So I normally don't use a fixer, but because we're going out today, we need this. Ha! Huh. So guys, this is my finished look for today. So I am pretty much very ready to go out with my little cute bag. That will be it for today. Uh, I hope you guys had fun watching me do my makeup. I think my makeup skill got a lot better and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that I will also be doing more beauty content because it seems like you guys still want to watch what I do for my face which is actually not a lot Anyways, thank you so much for watching I'm gonna go out with my girls I actually gotta just erase the makeup and film some TikToks and stay home Thank you so much for watching my makeup tutorial today and I will see you guys again in the next video of Purdue Soren Bye!